So maybe you want to upgrade your old laptop or change the SSD in your newer laptop and you're looking to buy the best SSD for your money. Well, here's what you need to know. First of all, what is an SSD? To put it simply, it's a storage unit that has no moving mechanical parts and is much faster than a traditional hard disk. So why you choose an SSD for your laptop? It's by any measurable unit of performance, much faster than a hard disk. It has lower access times, higher writing speed, higher uh, reading speeds and everything else. It just performs better, it's newer technology. Besides this, it's more durable. That means that if you are used to walking around with your laptop while it's turned on, certain shocks or stuff might damage a traditional hard disk and you get those bad sectors in time. Well, this is not the case with an SSD. You'll have no such issue. They are very durable. Also, by having no moving parts, an SSD makes no noise, not even after years of usage, unlike a hard disk that might come from the factory noisier or over time develop specific noises, unfortunately. And lastly, an SSD usually eats less power than a hard disk. Now this is not a huge difference, but hey, every little bit helps. So what you need to look out for is the type of SSD. We have SATA SSDs and NVMe SSDs. The latter are more expensive and faster and not all laptops support NVMe SSDs. So you need to check your laptop specification to make sure that your model supports these types of uh, SSD drives. The next thing you need to know is the form factor. Now, if you're replacing a hard disk, most likely you will need a 2.5 inch SSD. But there are also M.2 SSDs and M SATA SSDs. You need to check your laptop specs to make sure that you, your laptop has an M.2 slot if you want to buy an M.2 SSD. Also, please note that NVMe drives come in M.2 form factor as well as SATA SSDs come in M.2 form factor. So you need to check by the specific model of your laptop. You'll probably find it on the back of the laptop and sometimes it just writes on it what type of M.2 SSD supports, if it supports. Or you can just unscrew a couple of screws and find out for yourself what type of SSD your laptop supports. As far as capacity, in 2024 I'll go, I'd go for at least 500 or even one terabyte of space, especially if it's your only drive in the laptop because space is good to have. Maybe you need a bigger game installed in the future, whatever apps take their space also. So yeah, and it's not that expensive anymore on one terabyte decent brand SSD. As far as brands go, I'd go with Samsung Crucial, uh, Western Digital, Kingston, and even Seagate. They all have pretty good models. And the, as far as the specific models go, you should Try and find a model, look online, look on the product data sheets. Usually they brag about this. It, your SSD should have a DRAM cache. That helps it make, helps it be a lot faster, especially when you need, really need that speed being be it write, stick or read speeds. That cache is a mechanism of making things faster. So for example, the Samsung 870 Evo has a 512 megabytes cache on the 250 gigabyte and 500 gigabyte capacities. On higher capacity, this cache is bigger. But there are models that don't have this cache. And other brands have, there are brands that don't have any drive with a cache. So be on the lookout. It's not the end of the world, but it's just nice to have for a fast SSD. Now, as we're speaking of a fast SSD, it's pointless sometimes based on your, if you want the best bang for your buck, sometimes it's just pointless to go for the fastest SSD out there. A 5% difference in, I don't know what, benchmark or uh, half a second speed in that loading screen in a game might not, not matter so much if you're paying a hefty premium when you could just get a bigger drive. And while we're at it, a bigger drive, when we're talking about SSDs, 
is usual, usually faster and more durable. That's just how things work. I won't go into detail in this video. And finally, probably any SSD from any decent brand is a lot better than a traditional hard disk. Just because it's newer tech, it's faster. And I promise you when comparing the same laptop with an SSD versus an HDD, you'll notice that everything is snappier. The system boots faster, programs load faster, and everything just works faster. It's quite an amazing upgrade you can do, relatively cheap on a modern laptop. So if you've liked this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the Techie Show channel, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.